All right, we're gonna start here. This is at the door. Looks pretty dry all there. Very dry all there. And then we go around the corner here. This is around the right side of the house. It's dry all there. Dry there. Dry everywhere. It's dry there. Then we start getting under the master bathroom here. It's dry. Start seeing some stuff there. And on that wall too. So there's some issues there. It's not so bad, but there's definitely some moisture issues. All right, not sure where that correlates on the outside, but we'll look. Then you go around the corner. It's low down, we've got some stuff here. You know, and on the bottom, we've got vapor barrier here, and over there where there is issues, we don't have vapor barrier. Not sure there's a correlation between that, but just noting it. It's dry at the top, but again, we're wet on the bottom here. And then we get to here. I think that orange coloration is just the coloration of the OSB. I don't think there's anything about that, but this stuff is all very much moisture. Um, then we get to the outside corner. It's blocked, but you can see there's a lot of moisture coming through the ground. Um, that's, that's a lot of moisture. <laughs> you can actually see it on the lower blocks here too. Um, a little bit all the way, but very much so. Ground level there, all the way up and up to there. Then we go around the corner here. We've got spots that are still doing water. We got water inside the blocks there. I don't know what that is. <clears throat> then we're going over here. There's some moisture on the bottom there. Not so bad. Let's get around this post. We still are all brick here. There's some moisture. It's not as bad as it could be. This corner is really bad. Um, I'm not sure where I am on the outside, but it's very wet there. Not so bad there. Going around. Keep going. <clears throat> that might be to the right side of the entry. That might be the entry over there. And this is that corner below the dining room, possibly. So I'll see if I can correlate that later. Um... This is a very small inside corner here. Ugh. This is under the kitchen. You can see it's pretty dry actually over here. Seems to be the higher side too. Ugh. Sorry for the bad video here. It's kind of hard to get around. And this is, maybe that's the front room and this is the kitchen. I think that might have been garage up there or something. Anyway, I'm not exactly sure. I think this is definitely kitchen. We got a big vent there. Piping. There's definitely moisture along this wall. You can see that. Big old to the street plumbing there. All right, let's get under this. All right. Now this is under that bay window in the breakfast area. Very moist. You can see it all over the place on that. All the way everywhere. Especially on the outer ones though. Very moist. That's not just surface moist, that's moisture coming through, but it's worse here. This looks to be the edge of it, and that's the main crux, and then a main crux, and then an edge again. And uh, that is under the breakfast nook area. Come around the corner, 
it's pretty bad there not as bad as in other places but certainly getting moisture in it very bad here this uh, I can actually see daylight through there I think you can see that yeah now you can see it for sure anyway daylight right through there the other corner that's probably the same that's probably the outside door there to there that is about three feet apart so that's probably that door and that's what that is that is definitely the door very bad um got some kind of puffball or something growing there so that's pretty bad anyway there's that come around the corner here this is on that little entryway by the deck door it's uh it's got moisture that's for sure moisture into there let's see back here yeah, it's residual there seems to be coming from just over there then it gets dry again except at the bottom very dry there then we come back over here and this is this is directly under the chimney it's not so good in that corner same thing here there in that corner then it gets dry a little bit at the bottom there you can see it not as bad that's for sure then we get to the right of the chimney this is that window to the right of the chimney it's pretty bad um, you can see it's all over here's the main thrust of it this is directly below that outlet which may be the main thing there this low and then it goes on over to the chimney itself it's pretty bad and then we come around the corner here this is the bump out starting in the master bedroom that's directly next to that wall so it's residual coming through coming through there I think it's to be nice and dry let me see if I can get a better angle here then it's very dry under the bedroom so that's very good I don't see any issues except a little bit at the bottoms but that's pretty minor I will say compared to what we see and then uh, going this way to the right looks good looks good there that's next to the door that's full circle of the house 